So I think this is the new car they have in. It's really nice. Color in the price 32, 32,024 and something. Welcome to my channel once again. If today is your first time here, I'm Mavis, Ghanaian living in Belgium. Guys, at the garage, bringing my car for the yearly car service. I will be traveling tonight to UK together with my husband and the kids. And, hello. And I'm going to have a bomb issue with you. I'm going to have a bomb issue with you. I'm going to have a bomb issue Nowadays, if I'm traveling, like I'm always unprepared. Is it has been work, 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 work. Came from, came back from the night shifts. I slept for like three hours. And then I had an appointment here, and then we'll have to take the kids to the baba to shave their hair, and then pack, find something to eat. We are traveling tonight, hmm, guys. Like yeah. Is a Renault car company. Yeah, what's that? Yeah, mm. yeah. on the second that here the van kleur. Yeah. Uh, was onderhoud en nazichtschouwing. Is it staan? Was that it? Onderhoud en nazichtschouwing. Yeah, so jealous control. Yeah. Yeah. Normal is the IT yeah, but no problem. I can just one handtekening vragen and the service van the auto. Thank you. Yeah. Oh. There is the waiting space. I really hate it. I'm going to take a uh, choco milk. Starts. What will you have? Opa, there. No, 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 no. I'm going to drink it. Opa, for chocolate milk. Mmm, keep in any. So yeah, guys. I went to pick the kids when I wake up, and then I came to the garage with the kids. And it's, it's going to take like two hours for them to finish. As of now, it's like 3 p.m. So they will finish around 5 p.m. And I think my husband will also pass here. And we will all go to the Baba and we'll go home together. And we start to park. I'm going to show you guys around there to check the cars. What they have here out, the cars out. In case you'd be interested in having a new car. <laughs> guys sorry for my look eh? i woke up not long ago so i have a sleeping face let me show you guys around let me show you guys around. so i think there's the new car they have in it's really nice and that's the gray color of it that's the gray color and that's the red color and the price 32 32,024 and something and normally if you buy it and they always take some some um euros of let's say three thousand four thousand because ours it was thirty one thousand something and they took four thousand off so we got it for twenty six something let's check the inside out and this is the renault what's the name renault new akana or so yeah so that's how the front i think it's electric car i think this is electric car this is electric car the inside will be great i guess so that's how the inside look like with ours you can pull this but this you can't pull um, it's a nice car it's simple and nice so you put your drinks here the brake that's your screen a uh, very nice a very nice car but it's not as spacious and then you have the upstairs there and that's the side way it's not that spacious though but it's really nice and you have somewhere to charge your phones a space in case you want to keep something yeah you have extra space here it's not bad it's not bad 
let me check the boots oh okay it's automatic oh nice okay so the back space is really spacious the back space is really spacious and that's the other color same car okay and then that's the same car same price but in different color and what car is this this is renault yeah guys so this is renault megan renault megan pick for forty-seven thousand. wow that's this one the price is a bit huge really nice eh? check it out guys this is nice i think it's also electric car space to charge i guess so you open you open it like this hey wow i'm loving this i love the texture here they have it here too wow i really love this and that's the screen wow this is nice you also have another screen here Ooh. hey me and me i'm crazy about renault cars i really love renault cars but my next car is surely not going to be a renault it's maybe going to be a seven seater automatic i guess so is this automatic or what because i can't see any gear here and you can how do you open here oh okay you pull it in you have space here so where is your gear eh? hey this car our oh, your gear will be here somewhere here i don't see anything in the back space you open the back space here mm, okay this is also a bit spacious So you use here to open the back. Wow, this is nice, hey eh, guys. This is so nice. Uh -huh. Also spacious, guys. Oh yeah, it's electric car. So you use this to to charge your phone, uh, uh, your car. Wow, this is nice, really nice. And I think these are old cars, cause they have Peugeot here. This Peugeot. So I think this is a second-hand car. Yeah, someone have used it. 60,000 kilometers, 22,000 euros. Okay. Mm, I think maybe the person used it for um, quite some years. Mm, this Peugeot, eh? This is a second hand car. It's also not bad. Really, really not bad. Uh, yeah, it's a second hand car. I can see some scratches here. And this is our car, Renault Selection. Is it Renault Scenic? Yeah. Our car is Renault Scenic 2018. Yeah. And this is also an old car. Yeah. You see, Renault 2018 and 15,000 kilometers. The kilometers is very little for 21,000. We got ours for ours was 30 something thousand they took four thousand off so we got it for almost twenty seven thousand like twenty eight thousand something and we have fifty thousand uh, kilometers so in case we, we we want to sell ours it will be lesser than twenty one thousand euros yeah wow so this is a second hand car so this is how our car inside looks like here yeah? is the same as this then you have something to open here you have a space here you have a space there you can also pull it back yeah and then the screen but our screen is different from this ours is a bit modern ours is modern eh no this one is old this type is old ours is modern ours is modern like the interior is the same this year is the same but the screen is different from ours ours is really modern like the modern type and with ours you have yeah it's the modern type ours is the new new type but the interior and the inside is the same but the screen is different and the back side is really spacious that's what i love about our car the back side is really really spacious you see you have a whole lot of space here and then the boots also spacious 
you see how the boots is very very spacious and then you have something here the abscess too yeah so right now they don't ha have new cars here i think the only new car they have here is the renault this type this time i think it's megan guys what's the name please they have this type that is the new car they have here check it out it's really really cute hey, really cute and this is also the new type they have here oh very very cute guys mm -hmm. yeah so that's what they have here but my next car my next car is surely not going to be our next car is surely not surely not going to be a renault it's not going to be a renault yeah it's going to be automatic car i guess i don't know but i really love manual car like you can control you can change the gs yourself i love manual car but um i think it's maybe we, we will go for automatic and then yeah you do why right, baby this garage they are really their things are so expensive normally if we come for yearly control it's always around 150 180 but this time around they told me it's over 400 euros i'm like yeah hey you ready to come and come and come before from Ankara North shop but since we are traveling tomorrow it's too late i can't make any appointment as a name of boni person and then i also they also told me that there is something small like the rem shift, something with the brake shift or something that we have to change it and here only that one the front is over 600 euros here so i just call a different garage to ask their price and they are saying it will be around 400 500 so i think we will first go to the uk and when we come back i'll go to that garage in Iklo and change it because i'm in ghent right now i came to ghent so next year my yearly control i won't go to renault shop because really it's getting so expensive normally the year control maximum it should be 200 or 250 or you know but here is over 400 but i don't have a choice because we are traveling tomorrow with the car so at least we have to do it and the um, brake sh uh, shifts is um rem shift here they call it rem shift in netherlands so the brake shift and the brake um knob also i don't know that one i can't do it right now because i don't when i break i don't hear noise so i call the other garage they say that if you don't hear noise then it's not as serious so we first go to the uk and when we are back i will take my time and change it because here together with the break um shift they are saying it's over a thousand euros like right now when they finish i have to pay over a thousand euros i'm like hey you just do the normal yearly control they said they have to change uh, some other things too that's why it's expensive this time around because normally i always pay 100 and something no more than 200. it's not easy hey jesus so when we come back from uk we have to change that thing and that one too will cost around 500 or around 400. hey yeah seven hmm boy uh, guys yeah, but so. these renault garage they are thieves really if you use car it's wahala if you don't use car it's also wahala and the problem i'm like um i'm having right now we bought the car 2018 almost ending 2018 november 2018 and here normally you have to take your car every year to so there is a place you take your car for them to check if your car is in um in a good shape before you can use your car here in belgium so if your car is a new car since we bought it as new the first four years you don't go to that special yearly control here in belgium it's after four years that you have to go for that control so we've been using the car um for like four years this november it will be four years and we have to go for that control and that control is the monday when we get back from uk it will be on the monday so i will try and see if that monday morning a garage can change the brake shift they are talking about around 500 and not paying 600 at least i can save 100 euro extra from uh for myself because it's not easy eh, for ourselves hey, it's not easy thousand euros in this spot 
um financial situation that everybody is in like everything is so expensive thousand euro unexpected bill so uh, yeah so they are just going to do the normal yearly control and then when we come back from uk monday you see i say hmm. ghana people are complaining that it's not like it's, things are difficult in ghana but really i'll say it's not easy everywhere like everywhere in our hala in our hala but here is a bit better because you at least here you have it a, a way to, to get some um some income money but in ghana it's not everybody that have that work and even even if you are working the pay is not good that's the only thing that makes here in europe a bit better than ghana but everywhere is no easier okay guys so we are done 400 euros is gone 400 euros 20 420 euros is gone like like gone just like that <laughs> now wahala okay so we are going to the barber shop what's the time I, I i hope we can make it yeah yeah guys so from the barbering shop we came to Korea to get some few groceries Everything is so expensive these days. Eh? Only milk and one water over 40 euros. Milk, one water, one drink. Hey, the way things are expensive these days, like it's too much. Eh? Mm -hmm. Let's pack and travel to the UK, guys. If you don't want to miss this, then please kindly subscribe, click on the notification bell, give me a thumbs up, and catch you in my next video. So we got the ticket. Miss our ferry. Our ferry was supposed to be.